What's good to YouTube, it's Jay here, and I'm talking about a very sensitive topic that has been an issue for a while now in this Empire War community. I, I've i learned a lot over the last few days, weeks, about a lot of the craziness that goes on in this community. I'm recording from my iPad because I'm not near my recording equipment. Happy, uh, Merry Christmas, by the way. Um, for one, there's so much confusion in this community because there are people that are literally begging for money for these projects when that's literally illegal you shouldn't do that i'm just gonna point that out right now that's illegal you shouldn't be making requests for money for modding that's completely illegal and that puts our entire community at, at jeopardy say what you will about that but i don't think there's a problem with asking for money to support like your channel or not even necessarily asking for it but saying if you like my project feel free to support my work if you would like by doing a b and c that's fine but to literally ask people for money for modding is disgusting you shouldn't do that and i don't care what higher quality mod you have you shouldn't do that it's it's not okay you're gonna you're putting us all at jeopardy secondly another thing i want to talk about is yuzong vong at war getting so much flack for apparently wanting attention i want to put this out there i've been a part of the beta test teams the dev teams for like a good seven years now? Seven years or so, maybe six. I'm gonna tell you right now, everybody on that team, they don't want attention, they don't want money, they don't want fame, they literally want people to just enjoy and or like their project. They are here to create a project for people to enjoy. And I'm so serious about this because I see so many people slander them because frankly, if we look at it, if we're being honest, the Empire War community is dying. Nobody cares about this game 13, 14 years from now. And I know that for a fact because that's something that's always been on my mind when it's coming to YouTube. I love this game with a passion, but the community has gotten smaller and smaller with every growing year. And that's because the game is just old. It's, it's getting dated and people are moving on with their life. And I'm just disgusted with a lot of people in this community that think it's all about the fame and the glory and the, the money. And it's, it's like, it's not. We, people are here to make projects because they love them. And that's literally what all of Yuzong Vong at War is. And I know this because I've been with these people for a long time. They don't want the fame. They don't want any of it. They want people to simply just like their project, tell them how they did, and move on with their life. They don't want the attention. They just want, hey, if you like our project, thank you. That's it. It's a passion project. It's all a passion project. That's all Yuzong Vong at War has ever been. It's never been about the attention. It's never been about how much viewership they get. It's simply been a project of passion. Ever since Disney canceled the Expanded Universe, that was, Yuzong Vong's objective has been to preserve that universe that I and millions of other people have loved for, 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 um, for decades. And that's it. That's all it is. I'm just so tired of all the slander and all the hate that I see towards this mod from a lot of small people that are just members and fans of the community to all these big time modders that have been making these projects for years and building these little clicks and I'm not going to say names I, I know a lot of information I have a lot and I will develop and make more content based around this as time goes on because I I have a lot of information I'm not allowed to disclose right now. And I, I, for, for respect of a lot of individuals in this community who I am still friends with and trust, I won't disclose any names because I know them, they, they should be better than this. But it's just really, really disgusting to know that there are so many people out here hating on one mod because they think that this mod thinks it's better than everybody when it's not the case. Yuzo Walking War has never once approached itself as we're better than everybody. They've always developed a passion project. The people that are involved in it all want to build a career based off of the experiences they learned from using Long War. And I know this for a fact. They want to build their own career based off of the experiences they've gained in News on Vogue War. We've got people that are still in college in News on Vogue War that are using this experience to go into the real world and the real businesses and whatnot. And they're using what they've learned from this to move on with their lives, their art styles, their projects. They've, they're using this all as a part of their life to, to grow and develop. And not a single one of them asks for a penny. I hate the people that are just like, oh, you don't want your war, just wants all the attention in the limelight. That is not true. They don't. 
Yuzo Long Award literally just wants to create a quality project and make sure we don't get shut down because we are at such a damn risk of getting shut down. It's not even funny. Too many mods, too many groups are asking for money for modding, which is illegal already. You're asking for money from Disney for, for a game that is owned by Disney. That is so on the scale of illegal, it's not even funny. I don't see a problem with people wanting to willingly donate. Like, if I were to make a Patreon right now and say something like, I don't know, if you feel like if you feel like you want to support the channel and the content I create, feel free to do this or whatever, become a Patreon. I don't see a problem with that. But if you're openly asking for people, give me money or I won't do this, dude, you're putting us all at a risk. You're, all, you're putting all of us at a risk to get anything we do shut down. And it's just, it's just mind-blowing to me. There's so much that I know that I'm going to fully disclose as I'm allowed to, to do so from multiple parties. Ooh, excuse the brightness. That needs to be brought to light. Because this, this community is way more scummy than you realize. And I'm, I'm passionate about the community because it's been something that's a part of my life. Been a part of my life for almost 10 years. I, I've started making YouTube content for this mod back in 2014, but I was playing it years before that. I was part of the communities, a part of the, um, excuse the shakiness of my camera. I was a part of the communities, a part of the, you know, the old days of file front. I, you know, it's just, I'm passionate about this and I would hate to see it get shut down because people are greedy and turning it into, from what used to be a passion project into something you can make profit off of. And that's just, not okay. That's illegal, and that's going to put us all at risk of losing something we love. So, say what you will about this. Hate me if you want. I really don't care, but it's the truth. We need to stop asking and begging for money to build a project off of or build our mods off of. Donations are one thing, but to literally openly basically want to get paid for doing this modding is illegal. you got to find something else to do with your life, family, because if whatever you're going through is too tough, I mean... I grew up in the hood where people died every day and got shot and all of that. So I'm just telling you right now, there are better ways to make it a life and how you can support yourself and build up. Like you don't have to beg people for money. I don't know. It's just a lot going on. When I get more information, I'm going to fully disclose it. But I really want people to just shut up about using a longer war. It's driving me crazy. Just because people are too, I don't know how much time a lot of people spend in their basements, you know, not interacting with society. But there are ways to talk about and understand the ways things are said without just immediately thinking, oh, they just want this, this, and this, and this. Internet culture is disgusting sometimes. We could do better. All of us could do better. Like, this, this community needs some work, and I, I cannot express that enough. So, um, as far as my content on YouTube goes, I'm still going to be obviously making videos about all the different mods I've been playing, but I've definitely learned a lot about a lot of different people within these communities that run these mods and stuff that have definitely given me some differing opinions. I still love their content because it's, it's great content. I love a lot of the mods. I like Empire War Remake, Thrones Revenge. I like um, Awakening the Rebellion, Republic at War, uh, Use on World War. A lot of the different mods. I've learned so much though about a lot of people within these groups. It's just like mind-blowing. You know. So for real. <laughs> Get some common sense. Use your brain. Stop hopping on the hate bandwagon or attacking somebody because your favorite moderator or modder said so, or it did something big. Like there's still people at the end of the day, you're, they're no better than you and they're no more powerful than you. They just make a project. And I mean that in the most respectful way possible. We're all equal. We all live on the same planet, do the same thing, survive. Use your brain when you get into discussions with people or groups or whatever and stop thinking, oh, my favorite moderator, moderator said this, so I should agree with him. Like that's just not how things work. Use your brain, use your common sense. And if you're out there begging for money, you're gonna you're putting us at risk. That's all I'm gonna say. So uh thank you so much for watching guys. Feel free to leave your thoughts on this topic in the comment section below. Merry Christmas. I hate to drop some negative stuff, but I'm passionate about this community. I don't wanna see it shut down. We need to get it together. And um as things develop, I'll express more about this later. So I'll see you guys in the next video. May the force be with you all. Peace.